I'm going to tell you a funny story about Dino. Every time I get into one of these cars with a gated shifter, I'm always reminded of the time. The first time I actually was in one of these cars. This is probably back in the mid 90s. It was, uh, I was working in television and I was working for Letterman and uh, he pulled into Television City with uh, a really nice 246 GTS convertible and, and the, the guys were all talking about it and, and um, of course I knew exactly what it was and, and thought that it was you know a pretty nice car and um, when I saw him he said you, you know you like the car and I was like yeah yeah sure so would you like to drive it and I was like sure you know so we went out into the uh, garage or rather the, the uh, parking lot and uh, the, he gave me the keys and I said, you're not going to come with me? And he said, no, no, I, I don't I don't really need to, to drive it. But, you know, go ahead and, and uh, start it up. So, of course, as I'm I'm getting it into the car, the whole crew follows me out. And um, we're, they're all standing around watching me uh, start Dave Letterman's car. So I start it and um, I'm idling it. And I look at the shift pattern and it says, you know, reverse is up. So, uh, car's idling and, and I sit there and I, I try to shift it and I put it into, and I try to get it into reverse. And for some reason I couldn't get it into reverse. I could get it into first, but I couldn't get it in. And it was nose in to the, to the parking, uh, parking space. So I'm sitting there going, okay, Dave, what's the trick? And I'm looking at him because of course, you know, the Dino's really low and the, and the roof is is uh, the roof panel's off and I'm looking up at him and he's looking down at me and he goes, I don't know, it's just put it in reverse. And I kept going and I couldn't get it in reverse. And I said, I don't know, I can't, I can't seem to get it in reverse. So he says, well, get it, get out of the car. Let me, let me take a look. So he gets in and uh, he puts it in and, you know, next thing you know, he's in, he's in reverse. And I, he looks at me and he says, oh, I don't see, I don't have a problem. And he gets out. I get back in the car and I'm, I'm trying to get it in reverse and I can't get it in. Of course, the the crowd is gathering and and all of my crewmates are kind of saying oh what do a time you don't know how to you don't have to drive a stick you don't know how to drive letterman's car and um everybody's giving me a, a good good ribbing about it and and i'm starting to think to myself well i'll push this damn car out of the spot and uh and get it into the uh get it going because i'm not going to let this opportunity pass me by um of driving driving a uh a dino and somehow miraculously I get it into reverse and I look up at him and I realize that the re the way to get it into reverse is you have to push the the shifter down and that stops the lockout because there's a little tooth in there and you basically push it down and it and it goes into reverse and that's the that's the lockout so it doesn't allow you so first is down dog leg first and what it does is it keeps you from accidentally going from first into reverse without pushing it down. So you always go first, second, third, fourth, fifth, you know, and reverse is just down and up. Uh, when I realized that Letterman was intentionally not telling me that it was down, you had to push the knob down. I looked it up uh, uh, at him and he had this big grin on his face like, I gotcha. And I kind of just couldn't believe that he was trying to do it just to get me to squirm in front of everybody on the crew and, and embarrass me. And, and uh, I, I, uh, I grabbed the car and, and uh, started up, got it out of the space and blew out of there before anybody else could give me more crap about it and, uh, and really enjoyed it. And uh, drove that car pretty hard down Beverly Boulevard in LA. Uh, but that's a, that's a story for another day.